welcome to vlogmas day 12. It is Friday, December 11th, and I have had a very busy, very productive morning. I am feeling super good about today. Um, I'm sitting at my desk right now, as you can probably tell from the background here. Um, I showed you a little bit this morning, got the bed made, got some laundry put away, got my coffee and breakfast made. Um, I have finished editing, exporting, and uploading yesterday's Vlogmas video, which was so fun. We did the Walt Disney World this or that quiz, so I hope you check that one out. That one was really fun. It was fun to film. It was fun to edit. Um, and then I have been, so work has been pretty, I wouldn't call it busy, but it's been steady this morning. Um, and yeah, so that's been keeping me busy and I have a lot of things still to do and things still coming in. So it's going to be a pretty steady day, I think, which is, that, that's fine. It's good for a Friday. Um, I have a couple of packages that should be coming any minute. So I'm just going to check that real quick. And also, I need to change my battery. So I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back. New battery. Uh, batteries are going faster and faster these days, guys. So I'm thinking it might be time to order some new ones. But anyway, um... I was just checking to see if I had any packages. So I'm waiting for one thing to come in the mail, um, which I'm not too concerned about because I will go and get that later. And then the other one is a UPS delivery. Um, looks like it's out for delivery today. So, and that is my Freshly Meals. So I'm excited to get some more of those. Um, but yeah, the other thing I did was I started a to-do list today because I have a lot of things I want to get done. Um, and I got a bunch of those things done already this morning. Um, so I took out some of the garbage that was in this bottom um, box here. I say that like you can see it, you can't see it. Um, I have a couple of cardboard boxes sitting over here and one of them I've been using as like a trash bin. So took that out. Um, I made a shopping list for this weekend because we're going out shopping. I do need to get some ingredients for two kinds of cookies that I'm gonna bake next week. Um, and I put all of the ingredients on the shopping list, but when I make my lunch later, I need to check and make sure that we don't already have some of them, which we probably do. Um, and then I laid out some clothes for tomorrow because I'm actually going to put myself together <laughs> before we go shopping. What? <laughs> um, and yeah, that's it so far. Um, I also need to wrap some gifts today. I need to go for a quick walk to get the mail later and um, a couple of other things on my list to get done. But yeah, I'm feeling super productive this morning already. So... I'm going to get a few more things done here, and it's 11, 11 a.m. I go to lunch at 11.30, so I will check in with you later after I enjoy my lunch break. Well, uh, my Freshly order has come today, so that's exciting. thought I would show you what I got this week. Um, I did do a video all about Freshly a few days ago as a Vlogmas video, uh, so check that one out. Um, kind of explains the whole program and all of that, but... Um, let's see, we got some Heartland Turkey Meatloaf. We got some white bean turkey chili. We got golden oven fried chicken and mash. Uh, baked turkey meatballs in the old packaging, so no picture. Um, and I've tried all of those. Um, then we have steak peppercorn. This is a new one for me. I have not tried this one, so we'll see. Um, Masterful Pesto Penny, Penny? Penne. Tried that one too, super good. Um, cauliflower Shell Beef Bolognese, that one I've had as well, also very good. Better For You Beef and Broccoli Bowl. Little bit focused. Um, that one's also good, I've had that too. Um, Hardy Chipotle Chicken Stew. I don't remember if I've had that one or not. And Three Bean ancho turkey chili pretty sure I've had that too and all of them are delicious but that's a good round of meals for this week I think so sorry for the horrid lighting you are in my kitchen cupboard right now I'm gonna go get these put into the fridge okay so I got this package from work and I wanted to show it to you guys I opened it when it came on Wednesday Ooh, we're not gonna show you that because no. that is my address but it came in this outside wrap it's from knack shops and i'll put their 
website, a link to their website in the description below because it's a cool place. This is from my company. They sent us each one of these as a Christmas present, which I thought was so cool. And this is what the box looked like. I will insert a picture right here of what the inside of the box looked like before I tore it all open yesterday. Okay, so there was a personalized card in here, which I'm not going to show you either because it has my company logo, but there was a personalized Christmas card. And then it has all this white fuzzy stuff, which you will have seen in the picture. And here's everything that's in it. So there's a cranberry orange chocolate bar. There's gray and smoked salt caramels. There are candy cane caramels. Chocolate berry mix. Peppermint cocoa. That's like a decent sized thing of cocoa. Mm. These are adorable. I assume these are to go in a cup of cocoa, the big marshmallows. It doesn't say that on them, but I'm sure that's what they're for. So cute. There's a little a tiny tub of matches because in this box, there's a candle. It's a really pretty. It takes me forever to get out every time I open it. It smells like evergreen so strong that it's like we're in a forest as soon as I open the box. And it's got one of those wooden wicks, which is nice. Yeah, and that's a cool little packaging of that little cork. Yeah, it's so neat. The little cork and, and the... Matches. And then buried deep down in all of this was this that I've already dug in, but... Dark chocolate pretzel handcrafted popcorn. It's so good. I was so excited about this. I thought this was a really cool idea. And if you look at their website, there's candy, there's like bath products, there's all kinds of stuff. It would be a really fun place to get a gift for somebody. So I don't know if everybody got exactly the same things or if they switched them up a little bit depending on each employee, but I thought it was really cool. So just wanted to share that with you. On this cold December day we are on our merry way Riding along just singing a song Barreling through the snow Bells are jingling, snowflakes tingling Rudolph knows where to go On this cold December day I am piloting All right, got some more Christmas presents wrapped four more feeling pretty good i'm gonna head out into my very dark living room here to put these under the tree we are rapidly running out of space under the tree so i'm kind of yeah doing doing the best we can here All right, I think that's about the best we're going to get. So, there it is. These boxes out in front here are just like decorative boxes of ornaments. But then we've got my presents for Jason and Jason's presents for me over there. It is getting very exciting. We are getting so close. I mean, we're 14 days away. I can't believe how close we are to Christmas. I'm so excited. I'm going to put away some of this wrapping paper and some of this stuff here and then see what's next. It is 3.15 p.m. now and I have been so busy. Um, after I wrapped those Christmas presents, I have been steady, steady, steady work since then. So it's been nice because the day's gone by fast, but also kind of crazy. Um, I'm listening to some Christmas music over there. Um, I subscribed to Apple Music just about a week ago or so, and it's been really nice to have that playing. So um, I've been listening to that, but now I think I'm gonna switch to some um, YouTube videos, some Vlogmas and things, because work seems to have calmed down for the moment. Got about an hour and 15 minutes left in the workday, and I'm having some apple cider, hot apple cider, and a waffle, which is 
pretty well soft and ready to eat. Super excited about that. I did put a cinnamon stick in here, which you cannot see, but we're gonna find out if it tastes good or not. Mmm, boy does that add to it. The cinnamon stick really adds. So this is just um, apple cider. It's called Alpine Spiced Apple Cider. I bought it at Cub or maybe Target, I can't remember. Um, and it's for the K-cup machines, so super delicious. And on that note, you can hear my phone ringing, so I'm gonna go back to work. We went for a walk. We didn't take you with, because it's too dark, yeah. but um, it like, was like super refreshing. It's nice out. Yeah, it's in the 30s. We were just talking about how depressing it is that we're gonna have a brown Christmas. Yeah. There is not a flake of snow to be seen anywhere. It's gonna be weird. In Minnesota? I mean, we've only got 14 more days. 14 days and it's Minnesota and it's brown and dead. Sad. Yeah. We also just had a giant conversation about life philosophy. <laughs> and uh, what'd you figure out? Not much. No. Actually, what we figured out is that we are sad for people who don't have any faith. Yeah. Because it seems like it would be, and no judgment, it just seems like life would be so it hard. It would be really hard and depressing. It seems like it. Uh oh, our light went off. Woo! It seems like it would be really hard and depressing. And maybe we feel that way because we have faith. Maybe somebody who doesn't have faith in anything would tell us that's not the case, but yeah. I can't imagine. And then we were thinking that we have the potential to double or almost double our lives before we die. <laughs> and that seems like a little bit too much. <laughs> you probably will for sure. I'm not. I, won't. I don't want to. I'm ready. Let's go. I don't want to die. Uh, let me be clear. I'm not ready to die. I want Jesus to come back. Yeah. Right this minute would be good. <laughs> We're going to go in and watch The Mandalorian. Bye. Bye. Hello. Hello. Advent calendar time. Ooh. Never went to bed because we're old. Yeah, man. And it's, it's late. o'clock, you know. Super late. It's 8.38. Oh, I mean, oh. come on. <laughs> Where have we been? All right, this is yours. Me? Yep. Seemed like we did. We do. I did stitch. Oh yeah. We did. Oh, stitches, girl. Angel. Angel. Yep. Okay. Cause you did everything, and then I did everything. Yeah, yeah. Okay, eleven. Here. I don't know why I have so much trouble with these. It is Minnie Mouse. Minnie Mouse. Oh, 11 right away. Mm, perfect. And then, in a twinkling, I heard on the roof. Oh. <gasps> this so is kind of. I was trying to run away. Trying to run away. Come on. Very difficult. Ugh. A little silver present. Mm -hmm. Now we got the friends one. Oh, right in the corner. 11. Oh, yep, right up here. And looks like we've got some little, more little Christmas tree hangy things, like some tags. They've ruined Cranberry Day. Mm. And there, <laughs> there's the turkey that Monica puts on her head. Mm -hmm. And then this one just says friends. And then on the back, it's, it's couch. the couch from the coffee shop. Those are cool. What do we got for the Funko Pop today? Well, let us find out. Oh, it's the star of the show. It's Jack. 
Ooh. It's the second Jack we've gotten. Yeah, he's got a little thing in his hand there. That's awesome. Yeah, maybe it'll be uh, several Jacks. Yeah, that's really cool. I'm glad we got more than one. Um, I forgot we were going to give a little review of The Mandalorian. Oh. Spoiler free. We will not give any spoilers. Spoiler free. Um, except you can talk about who's back now since it was last week's. Yeah, can I spoil that? Okay. If you are not caught up to current, spoiler alert right here, do not watch any further. Yes, do not. We will not spoil tonight's episode. We will talk about previous episodes. The last episode. Yeah. Yes. Bubble Fett is back! <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Oh, so awesome. I can't believe it. Finally see him in action. <laughs> like the guy that's like the coolest guy ever. And, and uh, I never thought he was that necessarily that cool. I mean, I came into Star Wars late, and he's in the movies for like five seconds, but he is cool. Yeah. He's, here. Yeah, in, in last in this week's one, yeah, episode. Sure. I mean, I've always he's always been my one of my favorites because this is his look. He just looks so cool. Yeah. But now we get to see him in action and get a little bit of a backstory and mm -hmm. stuff. So it's like uh, they're making all the old Star Wars fans' dreams come true with this series. Uh, you probably should show them what you were up to a moment ago. I can't now. You can't? Well, I put it away. Hold on. Stall. So, while he's getting ready to show you what he was up to a few minutes ago, um, the spoiler-free review of this week's Mandalorian, it was really, really good. There was one thing about it that I didn't like, and when you watch it, you'll know what the one thing about it is that I didn't like. It was something that was missing. Um, but the episode was good. I don't think we've really had a bad one yet. So I'm really excited to see what the finale looks like. And oh, look at here. Yes, it's green. It's green now. Because somebody bought a green kyber crystal. There's the hilt. Ooh. It was blue the first time when we first brought it home from Disney World. Yep. But now, but now he has I the got two kyber crystals. <sighs> Let's listen to that hum. <laughs> mm -hmm. I tell ya. Yeah, the man I'm wearing, I thought it was really good tonight. Yeah, it was really good. So, and again, some surprising things. Yep. So. Yep, they do a good job of keeping you on your toes, but there's only one episode left. Next Friday is, is that the. It for sure. I'm pretty sure. There next, was eight last year. This is the will be the eighth. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Next Friday is the finale of season two. So, and then we're just basically immediately gonna rewatch the whole thing. Yeah, this season has been really yeah, good. I it's think. been really really good. So, all right. It's setting up for a good finale, I think. Yeah, I think so. Well, we. Are heading off to sleepy town. Oh boy. I had to mention it, didn't I? May the I? force be with you. Yes, you did. Bye! Bye! We wish you a Merry Christmas.